Let's write the balanced net ionic equation for ZnSO4 plus NaOH. We have zinc sulfate and sodium hydroxide. The first thing we do with net ionic equations, we balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. It looks like I have a sodium here and then two sodiums here in the products. Let's put it two as our coefficient. That balances the sodiums. Now I have two hydroxides, but I have two hydroxides over here. So that's good. I have a zinc on both sides and then I have a sulfate on both sides. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Now we write the states for each substance. That looks like this. So sulfates in general, they're going to be soluble. They'll be aqueous split apart into their ions. Sodium hydroxide, that's a strong base. So that's going to be soluble. But most hydroxides are insoluble. Zinc hydroxide is insoluble. So we put solid. It's going to fall to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate. So we have solid and we won't split this apart in our net ionic equation. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into ions for the complete ionic equation. That looks like this. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. And note we didn't split the zinc hydroxide apart because that's a solid. So we kept that together. But everything else we split that up. I can see in the reactants here I have a sulfate ion right here. And in the products I also have a sulfate ion. That's a spectator ion and we can cross it out. Two sodium ions in the reactants and two in the products spectator ions. Cross them out. What's left? That's the net ionic equation for ZnSO4 plus NaOH. I'll clean this up, write this states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So you can see charge is balanced. We have a 2 plus, and then we have this 2 times the 1 minus. That gives us a 2 minus. So they balance out net charge of 0 on the reactant side. Product side, this is neutral, net charge of 0. Charge is conserved. If you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for zinc sulfate plus sodium hydroxide. Thanks for watching.